sorry for him because his act of violence has taken an angel from us. An emotional day in court as the man accused of murdering an El Cajon dentist appeared before a judge for the first time. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. The shooting happened last Thursday. It left 28 year old Benjamin Haruni dead and two others injured. CBS 8 Shannon Handy joins us live from El Cajon with what happened in court today, including new details just revealed. Shannon. Marcella, about two dozen of the victim's loved ones were inside the court for today's arraignment. Now, obviously, they've been going through a very difficult time, but today made it even harder as new details reveal what happened inside that dental office. Not guilty, 29 year old Mohammed Abdul Karim stood behind a lock gate during his arraignment today where he pleaded not guilty to one count of murder and two counts of premeditated attempted murder related to Thursday's shooting at Small Plus Dentistry in El Cajon. He had been a prior patient. Uh, he had uh, consistently over months been dissatisfied and gone in repeatedly to that dentist's office. Uh, such that his behavior was erratic and they were afraid of him. Prosecutor John Philpott shared new details about the shooting, which killed 28 year old dentist Benjamin Haruni and injured two of his co workers. He told the judge Abdul Karim legally bought a firearm just five days prior and burst into the dental office and began firing immediately without saying a word. He allegedly fired 23 rounds in less than a minute. A uh, office manager was hit multiple times. Uh, in the hand, elbow, and torso. A, a female employee was hit uh, in one leg. The, tr the bullet traveled uh, through that leg and, and into another one of her legs. And the dentist who was working in that office uh, was then uh, fatally shot uh, multiple times uh, in the torso, uh, some of which uh, appeared to have happened while he was uh, hiding behind a closed door. Haruni's loved ones quietly wept as they learned about the allegations. Outside the courtroom, his mom said her world has been turned upside down. It truly feels like there's a hole in my heart. Hilda Haruni described her son as smart and generous, saying his goal in life was to help people. I just want justice being served for, for, for losing this angel from our, from our world. Haruni's father, who also worked as a dentist in the same office but was not there that day, shared the same sentiment, saying while a motive is still unknown, the act itself was senseless. He was just an amazing young man with tremendous potential to help others, and his life was cut short by a brutal, extreme, violent act. The prosecutor said at this point there is no indication race or politics played a role in this shooting, but that is still under investigation. Meanwhile, Abdul Karim remains in jail without bail. He faces life in prison. He is due back in court on March 12th. Marcella.